A woman that was found murdered in Racine is now in her final resting place. Peggy Lynn Johnson Schroeder was buried today in Belvedere, Illinois. She was known only as Jane Doe for 20 years before her remains were identified and a woman arrested for her death. CBS 58's Tori Bocayas explains the special meaning behind the date and place of today's burial. This is the final resting place of Peggy Lynn Johnson Schroeder. You can see a beautiful display of flowers here. Today, she was laid to rest on her birthday next to her mother and grandparents. The closure, you could just you could just feel it in the air. Today, Peggy Lynn Johnson Schroeder was laid to rest in Belvedere, Illinois. She was moved from a cemetery in Racine County so she could be near family. This case means a lot uh, to the Racine Sheriff's Office. It also means a lot to our community. In 1999, Peggy was murdered at just 23 years old. Investigators say she was badly beaten, burned, and tortured. Her remains were found in the town of Raymond in Racine County. For 20 years, investigators couldn't figure out who she was, and Peggy was known as just Jane Doe. Many of the criminal investigators who worked on this case uh, tirelessly uh, to find closure. That closure came in November 2019, when investigators cracked the case, identifying Peggy and arresting 64-year-old Linda LaRoche for the murder. And we need to make certain uh, that the person responsible for this um, that justice is served. Today, Peggy's family, Racine County deputies, and community members touched by Peggy's story came out to say their final goodbyes. That does feel like a peaceful end. I think the family has found some closure um, now that she's been identified and in her final resting place, never to be disturbed again. Today, the Racine County Sheriff also thanked the community for their donations that made it possible to move Peggy here to Illinois. Reporting in Belvedere, Tori Bocayas, CBS 58 News.